controls how tight an arc it runs. Uh, you got variable speed up there? Let's do variable speed 2 to 1, not 72. Make that 30, 24. I don't want the same go too crazy. Now this is going to change the radius. This time we're going to run these motors, but these not quite as fast. Mm -hmm. And if you'll see, there'll be a, a wider arc motion. Got a little wobble to it. <laughs> You want to try to strafe? Strafe. Try a 12 inch strafe. And no strafe's not on your list, is it? No. <laughs> and it outputs the uh, the angles. Now it's constantly trying to correct because the measurement has error. Mm -hmm. And every time it takes a new measurement, it gets a different error. So what it's doing right now is waggling to the to the random error that the sensors are throwing at it. Mm. Now I can knock it off. Yeah, that wasn't good. I think it caught it in, in between. Yeah. Now that's used if you want to follow a wall. And that's her next experiment is to make that work, to follow a wall. Now, do y'all understand what it's doing right now? Yeah. It's taking an ultrasonic reading here and an ultrasonic reading here. Yeah. And it's comparing the two values. Taking the difference, yeah. dividing it by the baseline distance, then taking the arc tangent, or the arc sine, arc sine. the arc sine of that value to calculate an angle to correct it. Now the angle has anywhere plus or minus two degrees of error. It'll really bounce. Now it's pretty stable. Oops. Caught my hand. Did you see that? <laughs> I put my hand out there and it saw my hand. Mm. <laughs> you gotta be careful around these things because they're they're sensitive. Sensitive. <laughs> Sometimes the wires just come loose. <laughs> uh, the camera or something read your hand? The sensor. Oh. Alright, if I put this block out here, it's going to turn. Mm. Now, it didn't correct very well that time, but it will correct again. Uh. Takes a little, little while to recover. And we're not doing any real data averaging here. So we're dealing with fairly rough numbers. We've used this data in the design of the new robots to extend the baseline and then do, image, or do uh, data averaging to improve the accuracy. 
of the, of the measurements we get.